Hey everybody, it's a Telsonator here. Uh, just doing another video on my GT10B base effects processor. So I'm going to start to go through the effects select, and I'm going to start on the left with compressors. So on our very left here, we've got the very first one, the Boss Compressor models the uh, the CS3. The next one we've got is the Decomp that models the MXR Dynacomp. Next one we should have a Boss Limiter, so that's a stereo limiter. That's a nice one. Then we have the 160, this models the uh, the DBX 160X. Next we have Vintage Rack Unit, models the uh, UREI 1178. Next, this is my favorite one, Multiband. Uh, the Multiband lets you divide the low input signal and the high input signal into separate uh, bands. So we will have ultra low, then our lows, then our highs, then our ultra highs. And I believe you can see those by pressing the display mode button. And multiband, low threshold, there's my ratio, high threshold ratio. There's my crossover, right? So that's what it means by uh, dividing up the frequencies. So you have the crossover for the lows, the mids, the highs. And I've got, you know, just general tone. And of course the level that always goes with it. Hit, com hit the uh, display button to go back to the normal. See, lastly here we have the natural compressor. It has the same kind of uh, division as the multiband, but it's uh, it's just easier to control. So if you know your compressors very well, you'll see the B comp has sustain and attack, the D comp too, and then we get with limiter. Of course, we get the threshold and release. So these are all pretty sweet little things here. The multiband is my personal favorite. It takes a little while to get used to it, but it's a lot of fun. We also have access to those if I go over to the FX section. We can go... Uh, where is it here? I won't be on the other end. So you can have the sub compressor and sub limiter. And those basically do the exact same things. You can choose them the same way. Choose a different type here. Here's a boss limiter, the rack. See, it's all the exact same kind of stuff. And same with... Uh, go back here sublimiter there's the subcompressor so it's the same kind of idea you can choose the type boss compressor the high band light decomp you know some of the same ones oh the orange compressor from orange amps so the subcompressor and sublimiter has stuff that the main compressor doesn't have so there you go there's just the compressors for the GT10B enjoy